<laughs> well, we've day. got applause at home. I'm sure yeah. the viewers sit there applauding of us every course. day. Yeah, very sad. But when it comes to our debates this morning, if you want to get involved, that number is 0207 862 2222. That's 0207 862 2222. Calls from landlines may cost up to 16 pence per minute, plus any call setup fees and calls from mobiles may cost considerably more. You can also send us a message, though. Head to Facebook or Twitter and search for Jeremy Vine on Fact. Not Botox, but... Uh, yeah. <laughs> we yeah, never yeah. mentioned that. <laughs> Fans of 90s comedy uh, will remember Chandler Bing from Friends. He could not smile. <laughs> there we go. That still makes you so laugh. We, we had this picture not smiling, fair no. to say. OK, because... No entry. <laughs> no entry. Enter. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, it is a bit. It, you're it's for it, it, now you. So, because she comes. Get really nervous in social situations. You'd be surprised to find out. But I used to think, right, okay, I'm going to step into my Beyonce suit and think, what would Beyonce do in this situation? Just pretend that that's who I was. By the end of the night, I was in a great time. I was dancing. I was chatting to everyone. It was fabulous. I think that really works. However. It works when you do it yourself. Yeah. So if you're upset and you go smile, lighten up, relax your muscles, then I think that works. When you're in a bad mood or you're stressed and someone says, lighten up, yeah. oh, much. it works the opposite way. And I think uh, this yeah. situation is probably the same thing. If you're going into work miserable because your boss is making you work longer hours, you're having to get up earlier, you're having to, you know, whatever it is, and you go in and you're annoyed and your boss says, smile now to get in the it building. Makes it worse. Yeah, really. yeah, I've got some bad news. <laughs> OK, first up today, you'll love this. We are talking about the England-Germany Euros game. And should we just abandon all Covid rules and pack out that stadium? I know many of you will be in huge support of that. However, uh, Janine says, I can't attend... 100,000, and you get it. ...argument to Janine. You got the numbers wrong. It's yeah. not 45. Gone. After that, we are asking if teachers should start teaching uh, climate change protests to their pupils. B got in touch to say children are provided with an... Do you agree? And finally, this is an interesting one. Was Rishi Sunak wrong to splash the cash on a new swimming pool and tennis courts during the pandemic? Now, this has really got a lot of you divided at home. Eleanor thinks it's... Whatever your thoughts on this, it is his money. Keep those messages coming in on Facebook and Twitter. Maybe. A public <laughs> that will be a solution. <laughs> <laughs> right. So let's look. Here we This is the last moment. This monster. And, and let's just talk about, hang on, what have we got here? Germany, Hungary, Darcy. The score. 2-2. Two, 2-2. Two. Two, two. What else have we got here? Uh, Portugal, France. 2-2. Two, 2-2. Two. Two, two. <laughs> 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 I'll hold Sorry, it. <laughs> to be honest, that easel has a slight design flaw. OK, so what? this doesn't matter, because we're about to tip this into the bin anyway. So we've got all the early, the 32 results, OK? We've got the results from the, the group stages. Oh, hang on, we've, got, we've still got Slovakia, Spain and Sweden, oh, Poland. Yes? Really? 5-0 to Spain? Yes? <laughs> <laughs> Three, <laughs> two, OK. The <laughs> there we go. So that's it. All the early games are done. So what happens smooth. now? This is the... Yeah, well, smooth, wasn't it? Yeah. Lucky no this is knows. just a rehearsal. So what we do now is we, we throw that away. That's because you crashed <laughs> out. Very upset and it can't <laughs> be mentioned. <laughs> is... Drinking, they don't yep. social distance. It's and, an and Wembley it's way. To We're going to speak to Cyril from Greater Manchester who thinks it's a bad idea. It would. I'm on now, Marion. You're on now. It is the Kelly Don. Is it A, the lower eyelid, B, the arch of the foot, or C, the inside of the elbow? Find out which after the break. Before the break, we asked, what is the Kelly Don? And the answer is C, it's the inside of the elbow. I have a hobby, we always say that a hobby. Yeah. Yeah. We're going to speak to somebody who wouldn't mind. First of all, this is Margaret from Northumberland who says we have to get back to normal. So County it, Durham who says it's one rule for some and it's one rule for others. Go on, Pat. A little bit, yeah. Never say... It's about someone's team unless you know for a fact. No. Otherwise, you're going to get yourself into trouble. <laughs> I had this... Uh, we'll, we'll move on, shall we? Yes. Uh, we'll speak to Richard from Buckinghamshire now who says pack the stadium with the double jabbed. What did he say? Just, just, just the, the British fans. The British fans with... Yorkshire who thinks this would all be too risky. You, yeah. What is the best-selling sandwich at Marks and Spencer's? Is it A, prawn mayonnaise, 
B, tuna sweet corn, or C, ham and cheese? Find out which after the break. Before the break, we asked, what is the best selling sandwich at Marks and Spencers? And the answer is A, prawn mayonnaise. Yes, and certainly we are, but uh, <laughs> if you want to get involved in any of our debates this morning, then give us a call. The number is 0207 862 2222. I'll repeat that so you can make a note. It is 0207 862 2222. Calls from online may cost 16 pence per minute plus any call set up fees. And calls from mobiles may cost considerably more. To send us a message, though, head to Facebook or Twitter and search for Jeremy Vine on Vibe. Absolutely. I Got mean, it probably has like horns and, and five legs. Don't, don't mind, but I've never. You've got one there. What is it? What this is? Your card. It would say Crocs don't rock. Don't wear Crocs. Okay. Crocs don't rock. I... Save the Crocs. Don't wear them. This would be mine. I mean, this would be. Oh, you put the two together, and I'll come across. Town. Yeah. yeah. But why like do you not like prawn? Cycling or cyclists or just road safety in general. Very safe. Yeah. So, uh, so I, I don't no. think I have either. I since March once, but I didn't hold Did a didn't hold a plaque. Let's see yours, Dominique. <laughs> Oh, will people even be able to read this? I promise Love my handwriting. Yes, <laughs> are there any calls that we might worry, go to? We'll move on with you. Uh, OK, we're going to speak to Janet from Lancashire, who says we should teach children to protest safely. From Hampshire, who says uh, they are more important, there are more important subjects to teach than protesting. Mm. Essex, who says it's important to teach kids their rights. <laughs> Is it important? Those are football graphics. Great. Catherine, yeah, absolutely. We're going to speak to Diane now from Pontypool, who says he, uh, Rishi can spend his money how he likes. Speak to Eileen now from Essex, who says that uh, he... Oh, we don't... We, Eileen's now just left. Uh, Go for so a swim. We'll, yeah, exactly. So we'll take some messages. Uh, Charlotte here thinks that it's a bit sickening. I'd prefer to have politics. Before the break, we asked, what is the state vegetable of Oklahoma? And the answer is B, a watermelon. Postponed now four times. M easier. No. Would you consider switching on this far? You've got the barley. Stick with it. Bar you are an authority on the travel industry, so I'm glad that you've said that. <laughs> I feel like to go from here, but will they let you in? That is, that is actually I'm the main concern at the yeah. moment, because at the moment they're yeah. not letting in tourists. Yeah, but there are places you can get. <laughs> yeah, exactly. It starts with an I. What is Postman Pat's full name? Is it A, Patrick Clifton, B, Patrick Carmichael, or C, Patrick Coleridge? Find out which after this short break. Before the break, we asked, what is Postman Pat's full name? And the answer is A, Patrick Clifton. I grew up with her so that when the Hit Me Baby One More Time came out, it was like, and my teenage years have started. And that was it. She launched my teenage years. Um, but unfortunately, she's going to means that Jamie Spears, her dad, has responsibility for every aspect of Britney's life because she was deemed 13 years ago not capable of making decisions properly and that was due to a breakdown in mental health and on Radio 4 today someone said diagnosed with early dementia in her 20s which sounds very suspicious and whether that's true or not I, I don't know um, but she has spoken out for the first time at a court hearing in LA and she has said that she 100,000% wants this to end. She is done with it. She says she deserves a life. It has stopped every aspect of her life is being controlled at the moment. She wants to get married. She wanted to have more children. This hasn't been allowed. Um, and she wants things to change. Interestingly, her mum, Lynn, has actually spoken out as well against this and says that um, the relationship between her and her daughter is, is toxic. Her, sorry, father and daughter is toxic mm. um, and it, it should be finished. It's a... It's a, a the Britney? Free, yeah, well, like there's that. a hashtag free Britney. And, uh, the staff is based around London and in London there is a much more... Uh, there's a higher percentage of people from ethnic minority backgrounds closer to 40 percent so when True. you think about it if you're taken from a pool of people where 40 percent are from an ethnic minority background and you're still at eight percent it, it doesn't look lovely bit of footage actually it's not often that you see the pope meeting a comic just giving him a nice story about a gorgeous guy that does loads of charity work meeting the pope and he's turned it into a the headline letter. yeah it's in the headline and I'm, I'm i certainly do on tomorrow's show we're going to be joined by guardian columnist owen jones and nutritionist Lowry turner we'll be discussing the latest headlines including whether it's ever okay to give up on a lost pet one family in dorset have been reunited with their jack russell crumpet after 11 years incredible so if you've got a story like that we'd love to hear from you do get in touch and he's re resi tomorrow okay. i'm off first day off this year time to say